Good morning, good morning. Precious brothers and sisters, this is Sharon from the House of Prayer. Sweet, sweet spirit. Holy Spirit, thou welcome in this place. Holy Spirit, thou art welcome in this place. Omnipotent Father of mercy and grace, thou art welcome in this place. Holy Spirit, thou art welcome in this place. Holy Spirit, thou art welcome in this place. Omnipotent Father of mercy and grace, thou art welcome in this place. There's a sweet, sweet spirit in this place, and I know it's the spirit of the Lord. There are sweet expressions on his face, and I know that it fills the spirit of the Lord. Sweet Holy Spirit, sweet heavenly dove, why don't you stay right here with us, filling us with your love. And for each blessing, we are going to lift our hands. We're going to lift our hearts and praise. Without a doubt, we'll know that we have been revived when we shall leave this place. Sweet Holy Spirit, sweet heavenly dove, won't you stay right here with us, filling us with your grace. Lord, and for each blessing, we're going to lift our hearts and praise. Without a doubt, we'll know that we have been revived when we shall leave this place. Come, Holy Spirit, I need thee. I said, come, Holy Spirit, today. Oh, please cut in thy strength and thy power. Oh, please come in thy own gentle way. I said, come in thy strength and thy power. Please come in their own gentle way. Such beautiful words to sing to our Lord and Savior. Praying for the Holy Spirit to come in our lives. Oh, the feeling when the Holy Spirit is filling your body with strength and power. You know when the Holy Spirit fills us with that power. We are invincible. This is what God wants for us. There are so many times when we are weak, but God renews our strength and power freshly each day. And we, if we just worship him and ask that he fills us with his strength and power. Remember God said, don't worry about tomorrow, for tomorrow may not come. But he will fill you up today and give you his strength and power. Praise the Lord today, children of God. Play some music while you are worshiping him. Sing to him. Lift your hands up to him. Tell him how much you love him today. Don't ask him for anything right now. Just praise him for being here with you, filling you with the sweetness of the Holy Spirit and filling us with mercy and grace. He is also filling us with strength and power. Our Lord and Savior is worthy to be praised. Hallelujah. Oh, sweet Lord, we give you praises of thanksgiving. Without a doubt, we shall be revived when we leave this place. Come, Lord, you are so welcome to fill these empty vessels. So we are strong to go out and witness to a world that is sick right now and dying all around us. With all the bodies washing up in homes 
and on the roofs. And babies washing up in Germany. Lord, we know that there are going to be more disasters uncovered when the water recedes and more tunnels are breaking today in China, the Three Gorgeous Dams, where they're harvesting organs. We pray for these sweet, precious souls. We know that the carnage has got to stop. Mm -hmm. Lord, help us to help your children. We praise you, Lord. Break down the magnet trains that are so fast, faster than the airplanes. And that they're taking the children to market. Lord, your word says... We get to see the justice of the wicked. Hallelujah. And praise your mighty name. You are so loved, Father, Jesus, and Holy Spirit. Stay in this place with us, filling us with your grace. Thank you, Father, for your love and gentle, sweet Holy Spirit. Sweet heavenly host, we long to see the expressions on your face. We long to hear you say, well done, good and faithful servant. We will lay down our crowns at your feet. We love you, Father, so much and love the fellowship with you each and every day. Praise you, Father. Praise you, Jesus. And praise you, Holy Spirit. Amen and amen.